Hi guys, it's Michelle. Welcome to my channel, Grateful Creations. Um, I have two eight by eights I had poured on before. And to make them pourable again, I had to gesso, sand, gesso, and sand. And um, hopefully the surfaces are fine now. Um, what I'm gonna do tonight is a swipe across both to create a, tr a diptych. And my colors this, this evening are or by TLP, beautiful, beautiful color. And we have Constellation by TLP. And we have Boom Gel in Watermelon, Pearlescent Watermelon. And we have Boom Gel in Lily Pilly Pink. So I'm gonna get started. We, I'm gonna be swiping with black tonight. It's uh, the Aussie Floetrol and Amsterdam Oxide Black. And I am using Color Place. It's not, it's in a different container, but I'm using Color Place um, White Satin. Um, whoa, that's a lot. You do need a lot more, um, a lot more paint for a the white. I'm going to put this on later. I'm just going to do the swipe right now. Now, this is my turntable. It's old. And I put the X here because it is level when it's on this side. It is not level on that side. I just picked these up from Amazon and they're Lazy Susan turntable mechanisms. So I'm going to make my own turntables and I'll let you know how that goes. So I'm going to start out with the constellation. There's the uh, the cops again. Right across. And then I'm going with the boom gel. Boom gels are really strong. You don't need a lot. And this is one of my favorites, that watermelon. Next to the Lily Pilly Pink, it's so pretty. Oh, I'm shaking. It's the bottle. I'm squeezing it. I think I'm running out of muscle. Sorry about that, guys. My goodness. And there's the ore. Like a little tiny bit more of that on. It's very, very pretty. All right. So this will be fun. I haven't done a swipe in a long time. I, I keep um, threatening to do one. So here we go. And I am going to put. I'm going to grab my um, spatula. I'm not going to swipe through the whole thing right now. Oh, I love those colors. I didn't put enough gold. I went too far down on that one. I've got some white cells. I don't mind the white cells though. I'd rather have color though. Oh, this is turning out pretty. Now, once I finish this, I'm gonna have, when I split it, I'm gonna make sure that that paint goes down in the middle. Oh, that one's a nice one. I wish they were all like that. I wonder if I should re-swipe that. 
I don't know, re-swiping is never a good idea. <laughs> it never works out. Very rarely. Okay, this is the last one, I think. Pretty! Still have some right there. I might just leave that, but I'm gonna play now. There's a lot of paint. Don't like that right there. I want it off. Off, I say. Ah, oh, these colors are playing nice. There we go. Let me just grab my finger. That might be easier. Not really. What did I just do? Oh my God. Now I have to fix it. All right, fixed. This will probably get, um, tilted off. I really don't like that now. Know if I spun the right way. There is a lot of paint on there. Um, so the one thing about this is if I wanted to tilt it, I have to tilt both of them at the same time, <laughs> which could be a problem. Let me just put a little bit more here and then we'll, we'll spin it a little harder. I have the coupon code for the Shelly Art course, which I highly recommend taking. I took it when it first opened a year and a half, two years ago, and I never looked back. I mean, it's there's so many tips and tricks, and then you get to access to a wonderful Facebook group, which is a great community, and everybody shares and shares their tips and tricks and secrets and it's just it's a wonderful community all right yeah see that came right off anyways oh i like this guys another great artist to um, look for is Cindy Vanderveen. She does these modified blooms and she is spectacular at them. Wish I could just leave it like that. I know I have too much paint on it. Well, I don't know. I could try and tilt them both separately. I don't think I could pick them up and do them together. That would be quite the trick. All right, let me spin this again. Which way do I want? I want to spin it this way. That I am loving. Oh, all right, let's try it the other way. Well, that didn't work out too well. Luckily, <laughs> it didn't. Um, it didn't mess up too much. Holy sh! Holy crap! Um, I might tilt it now since I've got it <laughs> separated. Oh my god! You gotta keep them separated. 
Oh Lord, that was a big mishap. Sorry for the language, I'll probably bleep that out. Try and tilt this. Oh, me likey. The one thing I might have to fix is right here where I. Go over to the other one. And make it even. Is it like this? Now I have to move that down. Oh. Well, that wants to move down anyways. All right. So I got my middle covered, which is awesome. And there we go. Um, I might play a little bit more. I wanted to bring this out. And I need to fix this. And I didn't. This dries good. Well, let's call Webster on that one. <laughs> and I don't like this. This is coming off. I guess I could take the paint off this way. There's too much. I just don't want to spin it anymore. My tilting skills are marginal, but I'm really, really liking this piece. Okay, I need a different one. I need a teeny tiny one. Palette knives. I'm messing this up. I like that better. I should have put more gold in. I did a, a practice piece on a, um, a tile and I put so much gold in you couldn't even see the color underneath. But um, wow. What do you think guys? Should I play with it some more? I think this side needs a little bit more because that's got something and this doesn't. Hmm. Where do we go? I like this part here. I'm not going to muck with that. Let's take some of that white off. I'm just worried that it's going to crack. I put some GAC 800 in the um, color place. So hopefully it won't crack. Um, I like that. And I like that.
Ooh, ooh, ooh. Still worried about too much paint. <laughs> This um, color place is really thick, which is, I guess, what you need. You do need a thick pillow for this technique. I am really loving this. I'm not that crazy about those purple and the gold together. Um, maybe I can. That makes me happy. So what do you guys think? I am going to put this on a level surface to dry, but I'm gonna take you in for a close-up. I am loving it, loving, loving, loving it. Now where's my X? There it is, it's over on this side. <laughs> I just love these two colors together, the Lily Pilly Pink and then the Pearlescent Watermelon. And of course, I wish I had put more gold on it. Ore is really, really pretty. And it's pretty when it's, uh, when there's more of it. Oh my, Atlanta. Look at that shimmer. Ooh, la la, la la. Those TLP pigments are to die for. Look at that. Sorry, it's not, oh, there we go. Now it's focused. So you can get the TLP pigments at fluid-art.co. And they have a lot of other products. They have the Boom Gels. They have Aussie Floetrol. Now that's what I'm talking about there. Look at that. Oh. Well, I hope you guys like this. Look at that. Shimmer. Is that a bug? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, it wouldn't be a night without a bug, would it? Anyhow, I'll fish him out. Thanks for watching. Please be safe and create and please like, share and subscribe. Bye now.